Hello and welcome to another monthly mystery stream here at 5J Gaming. I am 5J and today we are going to be unboxing this month's Retro Game Treasure Box. And I should probably have done this with the big old camera. Just give me one moment here for it to show up the right way. Okay, oh, okay, oh, and I turned off the green screen. Uh, okay then, well, there it is. Now you know I have a real green screen. <laughs> anyway, this is my Retro Game Treasure Box for June. Let's take a look at what's in here. And in the meantime, I can just go ahead and reapply this filter. Because why not? Yeah. It doesn't take long to do. I don't change much about it. Okay. Haha. <laughs> it takes out some of the yellow. Maybe I should take it off. Ah, aren't I indecisive and stupid? It's true. It's very true. Eh, oh well. You get to see a little bit of behind the curtain. So, let's take a look. If you're not aware, folks, RetroGameTreasure.com, they send you a box of mystery games every month based on your preferences. You tell them what game systems you want games for. You tell them what type of games that you like. Like, I like wrestling games and I like skateboarding games. And then they, you tell them what games you already own so they don't send you duplicates. So now they'll send you games you don't have in a genre that you like for the systems that you want. And it's really, really cool. So if that sounds interesting to you, go to RetroGameTreasure.com and use the code 5J at checkout for a discount. So, let's take a look. First is first. Of course, there's padding and such on top here. Uh -huh. And more. It's unsatisfyingly close. <laughs> okay, anything else? No, 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 no. It's all games from here. Okay, we got Kenzie Rose watching on you now. Thank you for watching. It's got a hair in my face. Okay. Ooh, I'm feeling feeling a Super Nintendo game. Game Boy Advance game. A Game Gear game. A Game Boy Color game. And is it another Game Boy Advance game, or is it the first one? Hmm, where to start? I think I'm going to start with Game Gear. So, on Game Gear... Oh, and I forgot my adapter. That's great, I'll have to grab that. Let's see what I got. What is it? Super Monaco GP. Oh, and it was a multiplayer game. Sweet! little racing action on the Game Gear. Cool. Official Z Gamer is here. What's up, Z Gamer? Thanks for coming. Doing some retro games today. Okay, so let's see what the next one is. Um, I feel like I want to save the Super Nintendo for last. Let's go Game Boy Advance. What is it? Ooh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. I've never tried a Mystery Dungeon game, so... This will be cool. Nice. A Pokemon game. Wow. Okay, so so far we got Super Monaco GP on Game Gear. And Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. Oh, hey, it auto-focused. About time. That doesn't always work. Okay. All right. Oh, we do have another Game Boy Advance game in here. What do we want to do next? I'm going to do this Game Boy Color game. What is it? Can't tell if it focused. Dave Mira Freestyle BMX. Oh man, back in the day, sports games were getting bigger and bigger, all thanks to Tony Hawk. And things like BMX started coming out of the woodwork, and so we'll see if this game is any good. Cool. I know I had fun with uh, some BMX games on consoles. Kevin Orndorff is here as well. What's up, Kevin Orndorff? Alex on Periscope asks, how much are these Retro Game Treasure boxes? I believe they are $34.99, and um, you get three to five games, um, and depends on what you get in there, uh, the value, whether you get three or you get five. So each of these games um, must be a little bit lesser value if I'm getting five today instead of three. But I've gotten some really good games out of these boxes. I got Mega Man X on Super Nintendo, an actual one, you know, not some rip-off cartridge. And uh, I also got uh, Rockman 6, a Famicom cartridge, for real. It was yellow, it was awesome. 
Uh, I got Super Punch Out. Just some really good stuff. But so far, we've got ourselves Super Monaco GP on Game Gear, and it does not want to focus. Now, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. Ooh, that time it focused. And Dave Mira Freestyle BMX on Game Boy Color. Hey, that one worked too. Perfect. All right, I got two games left here. I had a Game Boy Advance game and a Super Nintendo game. I think I'm going to go Game Boy Advance again. Also, uh, official Z Gamer says, I love Pokemon and Game Boy. Nice. All right, what is it? Oh, sweet! Sonic Advance 3. Now, the Sonic Advance games are actually decent games. So, at least the ones that I played. I believe I played Sonic Advance 1 and 2. So, we'll see if 3 is any good. Nice, that's a good get. And then last, and hopefully not least, we got the Super Nintendo game. Kev Orndorff says, I'm doing great, just hooked up my old GameCube. Nice. Can't believe it still works after all these years. It's a Nintendo product, of course it does. Uh, Kev Orndorff says, Sonic, cool. Jesse Robbins is here. Welcome, Jesse. Thanks for coming back. Says, 5J, what crazy treasures you get today? You're about to see the last one, and then I'll recap, and then I'll play them all. I'm going to have to get up to get an adapter, unfortunately, for the Game Gear game. I totally forgot it. Stupid. Anyway, Super Nintendo game. What is it? Oh, yeah! All right! Star Super Star Wars Return of the Jedi. Dude, that's a good get. Oh, crap! Now, these games are really, really difficult. Like, really difficult. But they're really, really cool. So we're going to play this, and when we do, we're going to put it on easy because it won't be that easy. It's still going to be really tough. Awesome! Dang, I think I have all three of these now. Super Star Wars, uh, Super Empire Strikes Back, and now Super Star Wars Return of the Jedi. Sweet! Kevin Warner says, true. Jesse Robbins says, classic! Kevin Warner says, I remember playing that game back in the day. Yes, good stuff. Patrick's World is also watching on you now. Thank you. Okay, so as a recap, these are all the games that I got in the box today. We started with Super Monaco GP. Let me see my camera again so we can see if it focuses. Super Monaco GP, which really doesn't want to focus. There it is. On Game Gear. I love the Game Gear, so we'll check that one out. Then I opened up Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. And then I opened up Dave Mira Freestyle BMX on the Game Boy Color. And then I opened Sonic Advance 3. Come on. There we go. Okay. That took a while. And then, of course, Super Star Wars Return of the Jedi. Awesome. So... Normally I play them in order because I have to get up to get the adapter for this. I'm going to play this last. So Game Gear last. Let's go on to the next game that I opened. Uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. So let's check it out. The GameCube is here. What's up GameCube? Thanks for coming dude. Uh, what am I looking at here? I need to change my sources. Hang on. Change over to this. Gotta activate my camera. Don't worry, I know I'm gone. Hey, I'm back again with a green screen this time. And now we can play. Okay, so what do I want to play with this with? I'm going to play on a Super Nintendo controller. It's a third-party controller, but still, it feels pretty good. Let's give it a shot. That's good. It's in importing a save file. Must recognize it. Lekka Garla is watching on you now. Thanks for watching. Ooh, guys, I have some cool uh, news. So, uh, Twitch recently, just the other day, I think it was even yesterday, they um, expanded the affiliate program to now allow subscriptions. So, on the channel, that means I can have subscribers, and what that means is that I can make a custom emote for subscribers so that when somebody subscribes to the channel, they get to have access to a custom emote for uh, 
5J Gaming. So uh, another cool thing about that is that uh, if you have Amazon Prime and you've hooked that up to Twitch, you now have Twitch Prime and you get a free monthly subscription on Twitch Prime that you can put anywhere you want. So it doesn't have to cost you a dollar to give me support and then you'll get an emote. Now, I believe that uh, I'm going to do a simple one, a sort of 8-bit version of the logo, but I have some other ideas too. So I'll put that in there for now, and then I think it has to get approved by Twitch, make sure it's nothing like offensive or something, and then the emote's ready to go. So that would be awesome. But uh, anyways, let's take a look at this game, shall we? If we can... Ah, uh, Kevin Ornors is so hyped for the SNES Classic, dude. Dude, it's so cool. I cannot believe they got Star Fox 2 on there. Unbelievable. The GameCube says, me too, if I get my hands on one. Yeah, you just know they're going to fumble this one, don't you? Oh, that was loud. Is that really loud in the stream, too? Let me see if I can hear a preview. Make sure that uh, it's not completely unbearable uh, volume-wise. I think it's probably... Eh. Seems okay. Could maybe turn down a smidge. How's that for volume? How's that? Does that sound a little bit better? I think it's good. Sounds good to me. Okay. All right, I've never tried a Mystery Dungeon game, so let's see what, what it's all about here. Squirtle and Pikachu reading a letter. Nice, nice. Welcome, this is the portal that leads to the world of Pokemon. But before I can let you through, I have several questions for you. I want you to answer them sincerely. Are you ready? Okay. Let the interview begin! Can you sincerely thanks, thank someone when you feel grateful? Yeah. It is pleasant day at the beach. How do you feel? Awesome. Gotta love the beach. A delinquent is hassling a girl on a busy city street. What will you do? A delinquent? Oh man, not them delinquents again. Help without hesitation, sure. Your friend fails to show up for a meeting as at the promised time. What do you do? Uh, well, I might become irritated, but I probably won't let it happen. Well, I won't let him know that. So I would wait patiently. Outwardly, I would wait patiently. Uh, Kevonor says, I'm going to be smart this time. I'm pre-ordering mine. Well, they don't have pre-orders, to the best of my knowledge. I don't think they're going to do that. In the U.S., they don't do them, it seems, because there's too many. Too many people that are going to want one. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Uh, Game uses me too. Jesse Robinson says, 5J, you should get a job reading audiobooks. Those accents kill me, lol. <laughs> I would love to do voice acting. That'd be fun. There's a bucket. If you put water in it, how high will you fill it? There is no context here. What am I filling it for and what with? Water. Okay, they give me that much. Okay, I'll give you that. But why am I putting... Also, is to put out a fire and then fill it full. What do you do with your room's light when you're going to bed at night? Who would leave it on? I mean, I've fallen asleep with the light on on accident, but not on purpose. On vacation outings, you want to... Go with others. If you're offered a choice of two gifts, which one will you take? The smaller boxes usually have the video games in them. Are you a boy or a girl? Mmm, see, they didn't give me other, so I'm offended here. Just kidding. You appear to be the calm type. Yeah, that is me. You're capable... There's The camera's right in my way, that's why I'm kind of like, Ooh. You're capable of giving advice to friends with worries. You don't like to fight. You're a, a warm, kind-hearted person who cares. You must have many friends who look up to you. False, however... You may be somewhat gullible. That's probably true. As well as a little careless. <laughs> and even a little sloppy. Hey, whoa now. Is this guy like an actual psychic? What's happening? You might want to keep those points in mind. A calm person like you should be the Pokemon Mudkip. This is the final step. Who would you like to have as a partner? 
choose the Pokemon you want as your partner for this group. Oh, sweet! These are some good choices. Oh boy, Bulbasaur from the main man, my number one Pokemon. I gotta go with Bulbasaur. Of course his name is Bulbasaur. Get out of here with that. Um, Kevin Warndorf says that stinks. It does stink. No, 100%. Total crap. GameCube says, my cousin pre-ordered his NES Classic. Maybe it's just in Canada. Yeah, Canada, not the U.S. They get pre-orders. The U.S. does not. Does not. Uh, let's get you into the world of Pokemon. Go for it. Hang on, my light turned off. What the? Oh. Ah. What is this even for? Oh, the speakers. Rats. What's the rest of it for? Yeah, it's a heater. Okay, there we go. Sorry, so sorry. <laughs> Berserk is here. What's up? He says, I don't know what that means. Where am I? Am I dreaming this? I feel a pleasant breeze. I hear a voice from somewhere. I wonder who it is. It's all dot so far. Excuse me. Uh, please wake up. Come on, wake up. That's a voice for Bulbasaur? Not gonna happen. You're finally awake. Great! Where, where is this? There's lots of talking. Not typical of Pokemon, per se. You were passed out here. I'm glad to see you are awake. I'm Bulbasaur. Glad to meet you. And you are? I've never seen you around here before. Huh? You're a human, but you look like a normal mudkip in every way. Am I dancing to talk with this guy? It, it's true. I've turned into a mudkip. But why? I don't remember anything. Kip Warner says, I think I can mine on Walmart, Best Buy, or GameStop websites, but I believe that's after the launch. Well, that's not a that's not a pre-order, then, if it's after the launch. That's just an order. Just saying. Berserk says the same. Bulbasaur, um, you're kind of weird. Your name? What's your name? My name? That's right, my name is... What? My name is what? My name is what? I'm gonna slick a slick a slim shade. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. The old name ski, of course, is 5J. That's my name. Don't wear it out. There you go. Oh, so your name's 5J? Well... It's a funny name. Yeah, it's kind of lame, actually, but it works. It's a name. Somebody help! Please help me! We're not getting too much in the way of gameplay so far. Doesn't display very well as a, hey, let's see what this game's all about kind of game. Your Caterpie fell into a cavern. Oh, no, it's a tragedy. Oh, poor Caterpie. Oh man, we gotta help him out. Okay, he's enraged by a fissure. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Let's get to the gameplay. Are we gonna get into a fight here? Because I like that. I like that. Let me unplug my, my mic quick. Head for the destination while attacking foes with A. Try not to let your partner let a partner faint. Oh. Oh, okay. Got it. Ba bam! Ba bam! Oh, so it's kind of an action RPG, huh? Got it. Is A my only attack? I mean, it's kind of lame. Oh, here comes a Wurmple. Die, Wurmple! Let's level up! Let's see them levels go up! 
Berserk says, stuff's going down! By the way, it's all ages Berserk, sorry. <laughs> Official Z Gamer here says, how do I get the retro box? You go to RetroGameTreasure.com, no spaces in there, and uh, then uh, you fill out an inventory, you tell them what games you already have, you tell them what systems you want games for, and uh, you tell them what types of games you like, such as... I like skateboarding games, and I like wrestling games. And then they'll send you wrestling and skateboarding games on the systems you want and not ones that you already own. It's pretty sweet. And if you check out with the code 5J, they'll give you a discount on your box. So definitely check that out. Berserker says, my bad. No big deal. No big deal. I didn't want to put it in the rules that it's all ages because I feel like rules are almost like begging for trolls to just come in and purposefully break them, right? Trying to get uh, banned or whatnot. So, press B to open the menu before you act. Oh, okay. Um, so, yeah, I didn't want to put, like, in the chat rules, hey, it's all ages, because I feel there'd be some folks that immediately would just come in and go crazy. Jen's here! What's up, Jen? Hey, look, I'm playing a Pokemon game. I've never played a Mystery Dungeon before, and now I am, Jen. It's kind of cool, a little action RPG. I had no idea what it was really like. Miss, miss. Uh, Grizzly is also here. It says, hey, 5J, what game is this? This is Pokemon Red Mystery Dungeon. Uh, this is one of the games uh, in my Retro Game Treasure box for the month. I got uh, four other games as well, though. So we're going to play all of them just to see what they're like. But this is the first one we've tried yet. So far, rather. Jen says, yay, White Ace is here. What's up, White Ace? We're playing the first game in my Retro Game Treasure box, and it is Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. Never played one of these before. Oh, just got leech seeded, huh? Oh, you're asking for it now, buddy. Level, wait, level six. When was I level anything but one? Do you start to level five? That's probably true. That's how it always was with starter Pokemon. Woohoo! Look at them stats go up. Jen Rotom says, You know I love Pokemon. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. Grizzly says, I wonder what your setup looks like in your gaming room. Uh, what part of it? Because there's lots to describe. <laughs> you just mean like the camera and the capture card and the TV or whatever? There's lots of stuff. Proceed. Uh, Berserk says, I just came to stop. It's 2 a.m., so I'm going to head off. Good luck with the stream, Jay. Thanks, Berserk. I'll see you later. I'll catch you next time, maybe. Your team regains HP as it moves. Hold B, then press A to recover HP on the spot. Oh, didn't know that. I was recovering HP on the spot, but I guess it stopped working. Oh, that sucks. Go, Bulbasaur, go! We need you, buddy. This is the worst right now. Wake up, Mudkip, you dumb idiot. You just got hit. Wake up. You gonna take that? Nah, that's right. Uh, Jen Rodham says you start as level 5. Yeah, I guess so. Just like in the, uh, the normal core games. Bam! Take this Wurmple out. What a fool. Looks like we're pretty well full on HP. What this? Orenberry, nice. Execute, execute. Come on, let's attack this guy. Facing the wrong way. There you go, bud. Splatulated is here. What's up, Splatulated? It says 5J. Hey, guys. Jen says, I have all the Mystery Dungeon games, GBA, DS, and 3DS. Dang, I have some, some uh, dedication there. Which is your favorite? By the way, all you folks on Twitch, I shall soon have a custom emote available to anyone who has uh, Twitch Prime, uh, where you link your Twitch account to an Amazon Prime account. Uh, pretty sweet. Uh, I have a design ready. It's basically an 8-bit version of my... 5J Gaming logo. I have some other ideas, but I probably need a pixel artist for those ones. Um, I'm going to get that uh, submitted. I have no idea when it will be approved, but woohoo, that's a little benefit for uh, subscribers. 
do 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 do. Also, subscriptions uh, could help with um, the busy chats um, as well. Um, but that's not important because it's not so busy right now. And I'm still a little tiny stream. Okay, so you get the idea. You're running around as a Pokemon. You get the Pokemon that you, uh... Oh, what is happening? You get the Pokemon that you, um... Based on what you answered in the beginning of the game. So you could try answering different answers. See what it gives you as your own player Pokemon. Can I save right now? Because that would be good. But you know what? It doesn't matter. I'm a, I have a Retron. So I'm just going to use a save slot. Save the state. We're going to get out of here. We're going to try our next game. Grizzly says, you need your own Kappa face. I could. I was considering just using the, the part of the 5J Gaming logo, that which is half of my face, but without any text. So it's just half of my face smiling at you. That seems creepy, and that might be kind of fun. <laughs> I don't know. All right, next game. Moving on to Dave Mira Freestyle BMX on Game Boy Color. Schwa! I have no idea if it's going to focus right now, but there it is. Uh, Spotchard says, is failing at trying to hype you because of the chat speed limit of same message? What does that mean? Uh, three, uh, Jen Rotem says, 3DS, that's your favorite one? Your favorite Mystery Dungeon? That's cool. What is it called? I don't, I don't really know which one that was. Um, Jen says, belly mean you need eat some apples or something like that. It's true. It's true. I do, and I gotta move around a little in life. Go on walks with my, my wife when she takes the dog out. It's true. Uh, White Ace says, or just make it five J's. That's ah, a little bit lame, though, isn't it? I mean, it works, but... Come on, read it. Play it. Be nice. It's not being nice. Splash says, has wanted to come here and spam your Twitch name a few times. Why? Why would you do that? Wait, there's a chat speed limit? I didn't know that. Just read the game. Just read... <laughs> it did it. Such as it wanted to come here and... Oh, to hype? That's hype? Coming into my own stream and just putting my name in there? Is that hype? I don't know. That was a really bad video <laughs> in the beginning there. Looked awful. Is this how the game is supposed to look? We're going to find out. Start a new career. I have no idea what to think, so Greenwood sounds awesome. Let's do it. Find all five spray cans, get 18,000 points, get 1,200 points just by grinding. Okay, sounds good. Oh, yeah! Okay, alright, wow. Dang, look at that! That looks awesome. Oh, sweet! This is a Game Boy Color game? Wow! How do we do a trick? You crashed into what? Into the jump I was going on? Okay, okay, there was a, there was a thing there. Oh, cool! Another spray can. Grinding, huh? Let's see if we can grind on this thing. Nope. Vaguely grind like, but nope. A new trick available. Cool. Oh! We did 180 spin. We didn't even try. Whee! Dang, you know, as far as, uh,. Game Boy Color sports games go. I did not expect it to look like this. Isometric. Gives you a vaguely 3D feel. Oof. What the heck? Bouncing off everything. Grind on it. No? None of that? Alright. So we need a fifth spray can. I wonder where that's gonna be. Hey. Go somewhere, do something. Ha! <laughs> no hands! Hey! 
Sweet, I think that's number five. I'm supposed to get points for grinding, but I don't I haven't figured out how to grind yet. Ah! The B button! Woohoo! We done it! Got those mission objectives! A new trick is available! Whoa! A plus to the right twice is a front flip, huh? Cool. Let's see, Spot that says multiplayer on the NES? Multiplayer on the NES? I, none, none, neither of those comments make sense to me right now. Thaser Beams is here. What's up, Thaser? Thanks for coming, dude. He says, hey, 5J. Hey, Thaser. Good to see you. Now, this is Game Boy Color, and I don't know if this is multiplayer. Let's check out a different level, shall we? No, let's try the... Go to the menu. Schoolyard. Let's give the schoolyard a shot. Eat more popcorn. That is the graffiti that the kids are putting on walls in, in schools, are, is it? Eat more popcorn. Oh yeah, real rebellious. Alright, so. Let's line ourselves up. Get on. Oh yeah, look at that sick grind. Turn around, turn around. Whoa, holy crap. You've crashed. That's the lamest crash I've ever seen. Oh yeah. Now, this is gonna take some real skill to get any good at this game. Like, for real. Oh! What the? That was insane. You just falling over? What, what's the deal, dude? Let's go up this ramp here. Ah! See, now, in portable games have come a long way because now we have the Switch. Do a cool trick. What's the front flip again? It was A into the side, right? Front flip A into the side twice. No, that wasn't it. Oh, there we go. That was not it. Ooh, falling down. Sweet. Uh, official Z Gamer says, I shared the stream. Hey, thanks, Z Gamer. Appreciate that. Alright, so that's Dave Mira. I think that's going to do it for now. Pretty sweet. Those graphics are, like, really good on Game Boy Color. Dang, I'm impressed. That looks awesome. We're going to move on to a game I'm very excited about. Sonic 3 Advance. This, uh, the Sonic Advance series were some of the few good Sonic games. Focus, darn you. Doesn't want to. And so it won't. Whatever. We're still gonna give it a shot. Thaser says, I only had Tony Hawk in Game Boy Color. It was kind of like this, but I could never get the controls down. Yeah, it's, it's not easy. With so few buttons, it's actually almost harder than having more buttons. We had a few people watching on uh, you now, Dang Chaos, Joe O, Zozo Calypso. Thanks for watching. Okay, oh, it's ready to go. All right, let's do it. Ooh, look at that. I like the art style. The art style of this era is very good. Who? Cream the Rabbit? Amy Rose, sure, 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 sure. Dr. Eggman, classic. Though I don't remember when he went from Dr. Robotnik to Dr. Eggman. Does anybody know when that transition happened? Woohoo! Look at that, it has voice chip in there. Cool. Let's check it out. Oh, and we can choose from the onset. We gotta unlock a few folks. I'm a big fan of Tails. I gotta be Tails. Oh, and my partner, huh? 
My partner is Sonic. Eat that, Sonic. Now you are the uh, the lowly sidekick. What the? This doesn't. This is Zone One, really. What in the actual world? There was a bonus level just like that? Huh. What's up there? It has an upward arrow. Was it like restarting the level, I guess, huh? Alright then. Boing. Whoa, what in the world? Chow map. I am so confused right now. We haven't done anything in this game yet, and it's like, hey, check out these chows. Uh, okay, if you say so. Select a zone. Oh, this is like a level select, huh? Weird. Well, Tails is a fly button, and that's pretty awesome. These were Sonic Adventures when they started to change his name. Oh, is it really? Right here, huh? That's cool. Wow, Tails can almost fly forever. Look at that. That is a pretty good flight time. Go, Tails, go! Let's play the level, though, shall we? Tails doesn't have to take that. Honey Badger don't care! Woo! Ooh! What is that? Go, Tails, go! Oh! What is it? It keeps taking me back to Route 99. What is this? Is it a race? It's timing me? Can you do the... He can't do the spin ball thing, huh? Sonic only? Alright, that's cool. Oh! Stinks to be you, Tails. Oh, that's cool. Oh, sweet. You probably better grab a coin or two somewhere. Or you're gonna be in trouble. Yep, just like that. Big time trouble. See, I never know when to stop running. That's the thing about Sonic, it's cool, but you gotta memorize the levels before you get the full value out of the game. Whoa, whoa, getting a little haphazard there. Can you not run up that? Apparently not. Whoa! Okay. Woohoo! This is a wacko level. What is wrong with it? Nope, 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 nope. Not gonna fall for that again. Jump. Hit it. Whee! Tails is a cool dude. He knows us up. Whoa! I honestly have no idea what's happening, though. This is not, like, a traditional level. I found a chow! There's six chow left! Cool! Is that the point of this level? Find all the chow? Go, little dude, go! You ran out of steam. Phaser's a sonic... Oh, I already read that one, sorry. Go, go! With all your might! Oh! That's a cool soundtrack. I always loved the sound chip that was in the Game Boy Advance. Oh, cool! Oh! That was a satisfying little bit at the end there. Grizzly says, this is confusing. That is a weird level. I will give you that. I have no idea what happened there. How I ended up there. Why that level was so big and weird. But that is a sub-level to the first level. This is the real first level. 
or not? Weird. All right, let's just keep on keeping on, I guess. So if I recall, these are kind of meant to be more explore-based. I remember playing Sonic Advance 1 or 2, and I don't remember what phone. But uh, there were secrets everywhere. Everywhere. I gotta go back. I can't be rolling for this, apparently. So. Use your tails as a propeller, Miles. He ran out of speed. We need... Thank you, a coin, desperately. Ooh, 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 oh, oh, yeah, a ring, rather. I would call it a coin. To use to Mario. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Oh, boy. Whoa! Sweet. I like that the the tracks sort of change direction on you, but it's a bit wacky. Which way to go? What is that? It's being weird at me. I have no idea what that was supposed to be. Ooh! Well, there goes that. Not enough momentum. Gotta do it again. Whee! Oh, that's cool. Now, if only it was uh, easier to make it you know, chain together a cool, cool run. That's cool. That was cheap. Oh ho ho! Go tails! Oh, seriously, once again, how cheap is that? Go, buddy, go! Don't go back! Don't go back! He's gonna go back, rats! <sighs> All right, try that again, little monster. Nope. Somebody kill that thing. My, my, my. There we go. Full speed ahead, Tails. Don't, 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 don't. Oh. Oh. Good. Let's use Tails' power to his advantage. And fly everywhere that we're going to mess up going to and from. Again, how is that supposed to get me anywhere? Ooh. Try that again. And boom! That's cool. Please end the level with this. This is so cool. That's so cool! Just end it. Just be the end of the level. Oh, okay, see, that was awesome. Totally awesome. Legal Alien is watching on you now. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Thazer says, these level names have me so confused. They're weird. So apparently what I'm in now is Zone 1. And that was the first, the second course. Or we were before was the second one. This is so strange. There's three. I'm perplexed. I think this, they said it's a new adventure, but it looks to me like there's stuff here that's already been unlocked. I mean, honestly. So, I think we're not quite getting the full picture here. But you know what? I actually don't care right now. 
We're gonna save this. We're gonna move on to a game I'm very excited about. But this was cool. I'm liking this. It is definitely one of the better Sonic games. <laughs> so, moving on to the second to the last game before we have to go we'll grab an adapter. Super Star Wars Return of the Jedi on Super Nintendo. This is a really cool get. This is the only one I don't have yet. But I have played it before, so I know that it's awesome. Uh-oh. One second. Why does this feel loose? Weird. Alright, well, insert it all. Come on, baby. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, oh! Unknown. You gotta be kidding me. There's this. What? Ah, I love this game. Whoa, what is happening there? Hang on, I need two hands apparently. Oh, that was it. I was trying to take it out, but it recognized it. Let's play. <laughs> Woo! Oh, come on, not this game. This is an awesome game. This is now don't touch anything. Uh, too late. Crap. The downside of retro games. How do these contacts look? They look pretty good. I mean, they they probably cleaned it. So let's try it again. Give this another shot. Let's see if it's unknown. Unknown. Let's give the unknown a shot. That's not good either. Rats. Oh, this is going to stink. This is like the coolest game in the box. In a particularly good box. Dang it. I feel like I'm breaking my Retron right now. It normally doesn't grip this hard. This is pretty ridiculous. Oof. Pins still look okay. Sorry for all the microphone noises. Keep brushing against the cover. Okay. Oh! Oh! Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Jesse says, I knew it was too good to be true. Ha! Right when you sent that is right when it started working. Thank you for breaking the jinx. Woo! All right. Let's change the options so that I can play it on easy mode. <laughs> This game is so hard. Easy, 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 easy. Sounds good. Dave says, yes, now really don't touch anything for real. Jesse says, it lives! That it does. Human Froggy, dude, what's up, man? I haven't seen you in forever. He says, hey, guys, I'm back. Dude, what's up, man? How are you doing? Do, 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 do. Also, this game, nothing like the real Return of the Jedi. That's how these super Star Wars games work. Uh, it's take the bare bones of the story and add as much spice to it as possible. Lots and lots and lots of action all the time. 
Should Luke be killing hundreds of Jawas for no reason? Absolutely. Should there be crazy desert creatures that we need to blow up with uh, your uh, land speeder that suddenly has like torpedoes on it? Totally. Why not? Do 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 do. We're gonna skip that because we know how that goes. Human Froggy says, "Good, I think." Lol, you think? Sorry, I've been gone for so long. I've been busy. No problem, dude. Good to see you again. Ooh, the Emperor's checking out the new Death Star. Bad news. Commander, I hope for your sake the new Death Star will be completed by the time the Emperor arrives. He is not forgiving as I am. Blah, blah, we know the story. There's a little cin uh, cinematic cutscene. Looks cool. Suddenly we're flying some sort of thing. For unknown reasons. Does it have a boost? Yes, it does. Does it jump? Sure. Do I remember how to jump? Not at the time when I need it. No. Doesn't it also shoot? No shoot? No. Okay. I got it now. Don't you worry your little head. <laughs> I got it. Human Frog says, I also went to Mexico two weeks ago. Nice. That's awesome. Where in Mexico did you go? Mexico is just so beautiful. Beautiful country. Oh boy, I get the feeling I don't want to hit those. So let's try not to. And also, don't fall in the black areas, which are apparently giant holes. We gotta get past this so we can get to the parts with Luke. And Chewie. And Leia. I think Han eventually comes back. I'm sure after they free him from Carbonite, right? Makes sense. Am I supposed to get a certain number of these, or am I racing to a specific point in the map? That's kind of where I'm at right now. I don't know what my goal is right now. Looks like it was probably getting those things. Doo doo. Froggy says, I'm streaming also, so I'll see you later, Jay. And then Cozumel. Nice. Ooh, sweet. Human says, uh, Froggy says, a lot has happened in the past few months, but I'll be fine. I hope so, dude. That sounds ominous. Best, best wishes to you, dude. And I'll see you later. Thanks for stopping by. Jesse Robin says, hashtag Jawa lives matter. Yeah. Uh, official Z member says, what is your favorite Jedi from the New Republic? From the New Republic? Like, in the Force Awakens era? Because I don't really know many. Slash, any. Oh, I think I gotta go... I mean, I love Luke. I gotta go Luke. Human Froggy says, no problem, man. See you later, and thanks. See you, dude. You know, I didn't read quite as many books as a lot of my friends did. I read a few. I read the um, the trilogy from Timothy Zahn. Uh, what was that? Uh, Heir to the Empire. Was that the one that, that uh, Timothy Zahn did? Very good. Uh, I also really loved um, Shadows of the Empire. That book was awesome. Uh, and I really loved Dash Rendar's ship. Of course, that's not really visually represented in the book. So, you know, I must have gotten that from Shadows of the Empire, the N64 video game. But... Definitely love it. Do we have force powers? Force saber. It's a block. Jump. Swipe. Oh, snap! That's cool. Awesome. And of course, the awesome somersault. Whoa. Uh oh. Oh, that could be our death. Nope, we're good. We're good. What teeny? I'm telling you, man, he just slaughters Jawas left and right. But why would they want to slaughter Jawas? Is Luke's question in the first Star Wars. Totally, uh. Oh, crap. Are you kidding me? How cheap is this? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I got powers, boy. Stay out of my life. Ooh, we got a force power up. Hey, R2D2. 
We saved him from standing there by himself. Ooh, force vanish, force heal. That's nice. Force deflect. Ooh, force freeze. Awesome. He's got all sorts of force powers. He must have got them all in uh, Super Star Wars Empire Strikes Back. Oh, 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 okay, we're good, we're still good. Hey, there he is again. We're just gonna rescue him time and again, apparently. Killing hedgehogs. Uh, official Gamer says, I mean Old Republic. Oh, Old Republic. Yeah, I didn't play Old Republic. Either Knights of or just straight up Star Wars Old Republic. But I do want to play it. And uh, I now that I have a nice PC, I think I'm going to go download it. I think there's a free version now on uh, Origin. So I'm going to do that. Uh, Jesse says, uh, Alan Mayo, the creature's like, You came to the wrong neighborhood, Luke. I know. Like, what the, What's the deal? Now I'm Princess Leia disguised as Bosch. So she's kind of Jedi-like. She's got this stick. She does the loop spin in the air thing. No powers, though. So, oh, I was doing okay, but then, no. Well, let's check out Chewie as long as we're jumping around. Chewie's pretty awesome. Spin? What? Hey! Whoa! Uncalled for, dude. Ooh, that is a weak, weak gun he's got right now. You can get gun upgrades in these games. What you got for me, Chewy? Oh, there's your spin. Ooh, it recharges. Nice. He cannot do it in midair. Note to self. He spins though. Like he does a thing in air like that. Doesn't attack like Luke and Leia do, but still. Ooh, that helps. Wow! Hopefully this is the right way to go. Ooh. You can just kind of use that to get out of damage, I think. Why is it not working? Here we go. Nice! He's making a lot of Wookiee noises. He must be in trouble. He must not be liking how we're controlling him. He's pointed down. Is there something we can do? Downward? Oh, we can slide, by the way. Charge up! Apparently after you use your whole um, meter, you can't do it again until it's fully recharged. Because I was trying, and it was not working. Dang! That Jawa can take a lot of lasers to the face! That's one tough little Jawa. <laughs> he looks funny while he's squatting. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> ah, Chewy. I just looked at the screen and, and just roared for no reason. Uh oh, uh oh. Failing. Okay, we're fixing it. Oh, come on. down again. It's kind of my MO at this point. Just fall to your death repeatedly. What? Oh, no, no, don't let him hit you. No tubes, no. No boxster. I legit cannot hit him right now. There we go. 
Whoa! What have we here? I don't know, but he's going nuts. Holy cow. Wow! Hit it, hit him. Whew. Why can I not hit this thing? Am I supposed to ride it? Like a magic carpet? <gasps> it's a magic carpet ride! I didn't know I was playing Aladdin. R2! Oh. Pick that up. Oh, this is the first boss, actually. I do remember this. This is the gate to Jalbo's palace, and it is a boss. Why? Nobody knows. Nobody has to know. It just is what it is. We'll do that to get some hits and also avoid some hits. Woohoo! Hurrah, hurrah. How are we doing on this health? We're doing okay. His health compared to mine? Pretty good. Woo! Now, Luke, when he used to use a blaster in these games, he would always stand still. So Chewie has the extra benefit of being able to move. Except when he wants to stand still, then he can squat. Like he's taking a dump while he's shooting. Lol. <laughs> go, Tubester, go! Yeah, what's up? Chewie got you, boy! Dang, Chewie did better than anyone. Go, Chewie. Official Z Gamer says, My friend has an Xbox 360 and he got the Red Ring of Death. Sad day, dude. Sad day. Sorry to hear that. Rip Xbox 360. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. That's taps. I'm playing taps for your friend's Xbox. Oh, we got a gun upgrade. Look at this business. Now shooting fireballs. And we're inside Jabba's palace. We're fighting a bunch of these. What are they? They're pigs. What are they called, though? Other than pig. That was it? Jeez, shortest level ever. <laughs> che Let's keep going with Tubester. Game keeps his rest in peace. Absolutely. Oh, did we die? That might have been death. That actually might not have been a good thing. We might have had to use a continue there. Hey, look, it's little salacious crumb. Um, I would have preferred the gun upgrade, though. That was nice. <laughs> Whoa! Hello, little guy. Get these health swords. Literally makes your health meter longer. Man, I'm telling you, man, those Jawas can take some hits. Are those little tiny Rancors like little baby Rancors? Get your energy back so you can do the spin of death. Dude, those guys are tough. For real. Whew. Man, don't mess with those guys. Also, these dancers apparently want some revenge. Like, he doesn't pay me enough! D okay, that's just uncool. Whew! The hell sword. Good, good. Um... 
I kind of expect to be able to go somewhere. If we're honest. Did I miss a guy? There we go. I missed a dude. Oh! Crap. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Get the thermal detonator. What are you doing? There we go. Woo! These dudes are tough. What is the deal? They've got like force powers. Look at his fist glowing. What is he, Green Lantern? Man. He means business. Whoa. Get that health sword. Gotcha. Dude, I do not like these dudes with their little green lantern fists. Die! Die, fool! Is he dead? Kill the dancers! Innocent bystanders, why not kill them? What's the matter? Little baby rancors. They breathe fire! Since when does the rancor breathe fire? I gotta kill little salacious crumb. He deserves it. Get out of here. Servant, servant of Jabba. are there. Uh, Nom Nom is here. What's up, dude? Says, um, hello. Hey, how's it going? Jesse Robbins says, wow, I just remember how... Oh, wow. It's just how I remember it from the film, sarcasm. I know, right? Just like it. Yeah, like I said, it's like its weird own little fantasy version. Ooh, yes, we got a blaster upgrade. Holy cow, this guy has, like, teleportation powers? Dang, he was more useful to Jabba than I thought. How we doing with him? Not so good, I don't think. Row, row. Dude, he's kind of a killer. Hit him with your spin attack! Oh, I think we're doing okay now. Ah! Not when you play like that. Row, row. We're doing okay. We're gonna take him out. Ooh, the slide helps. Gotcha! Boom, and he explodes. Why wouldn't our, an organic creature explode? Why wouldn't they? <laughs> Nom Nom says, Star Wars! That's right, old Star Wars. Super Nintendo Star Wars. Ooh, Leia is busy. We're actually going to quit this and grab what we need here, so... Ooh, cool looking level, though. Ooh, we're on the run. Wookie on the run. Wookie on the run. It's a song by Paul McCartney and Wings. All right. Sweet. So the last game that we got in the box requires an adapter. What just happened? No. No. No, don't do that. And so I got to get up and get it because I forgot to grab it beforehand. So we're going to get a little bit of, uh, you know, good old smooth sailing here as I have to move everything out of my way. I've entrapped myself in here. All right, hang on. Lots of noise and commotion. Sorry. 
sorry. Please have a long enough extension cord. Hang on. There we go. All right, now I got to put in this bad boy into the Retron. Now Mom says, where's Boba Fett? I think there's probably a boss fight with Boba Fett in there. Just saying. Oh, that sounded terrible taking it out, but hey, I got it. All right, last game, folks. Super Monaco GP on the Game Gear. Probably should have started with that one, but like I said, I didn't want to get up to get that adapter till the end. Please work in the first insert, because I don't want to have to I'm going to try something else, though. Don't unplug the whole thing. Just the Game Gear cart into the adapter. I'm going to watch these lights, see if it's going to start recognizing it. The Game Gear ones seem to be a little picky. Come on. Well, we went through some trouble to get uh, Super Star Wars Return of the Jedi to work, so this one can work too. Classic. Gotta love it. Come on. Come on. Shamo. on. No. All right. Gonna have to keep working on it. Two hands. If I can. Maybe I'm missing the magic touch. Come on. Come on. Nom Nom says, hey, do you know Five Nights with Froggy? I don't, I've never heard of that. And then he goes on to say, this is taking forever. Yes, it is, and I'm very sorry. Visual G Z Gamer says, what recording software do you use? I use Open Broadcaster Software, or OB OBS. Very common out there, very popular. <sighs> All right, I'm going to give it just a few more shots here, because I would love to have every game in this box work for you guys. I'm going to give it another shot. Hang on, i got to move this out of the way again. i got to have my space to work on it.
Well, I guess there's a reason why we saved it for last, because it wasn't going to work. Nom Nom says, it's been 30 years! Seems like it, doesn't it? Ah, okay, guys, I'm, I'm going to give up on it here. I don't want to yet have to sit here for 75 minutes and just watch me struggle with it. So, we played four games, though, today, and it was a really good box. So, uh, I shall remind you what was playable and what was not. If I can find there it is. Okay. Let's get back to the big screen, so another little fiddling around here. Just one moment, one moment. Now, this is this is the one we want. We just got to get my uh, camera on. Blah, blah, blah. There you go. Oh, and it's got the green screen. Cool. So as a reminder, for, oh, hello. I didn't realize all that was back there. <laughs> There's this, hey, no worries. That was fun. Thanks, dude. As a reminder, in our retro game treasure box this month, we got Super Monaco GP, which we could not get to work, unfortunately. But it's there, and I'll have to try it again later. And then we got Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team on the Game Boy Advance. And that was pretty cool, a little action RPG. I'd never tried one before. Sonic Advance 3. Come on. Focus. Focus. It's a bad webcam. Not a good webcam. Alright, it's not going to do it. Things hate me today. <laughs> and Dave Mira Freestyle BMX on the Game Boy Color. Oh, this one's not going to like me either. What? It's for real? Man. It's just turning on me, guys. It's a mutiny. I gotta get out of here. And then Super Star Wars Return of the Jedi on Super Nintendo. Which, of course, we just finished playing. And even this one won't focus. It's taking up the whole can. There you go. Oh, yeah. Nice. Uh, Nom Nom says, when is your next stream and what game? That is hard for me to say. I got some stuff going on right now that I don't know. I was planning on streaming tomorrow. And I was planning to make it some Earthbound because Earthbound kind of got the shaft last weekend. So, hoping to catch up a bit on Earthbound because we're going to finish it soon. I don't know how many more hours left, but it sounds like not many. Not many, so that would be great. Um, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to stream tomorrow. Then, uh, it's 4th of July weekend, so I got plans. I'm going up to my parents' cabin. So, I probably won't stream Saturday. Probably not Sunday. Monday? Maybe, but not likely. Tuesday, I'll be open all day for sure. So I'll definitely stream Tuesday. So I got to figure out um, exactly how the weekend works. And I don't know yet. I don't know. It's fuzzy. What time? Um, yes. <laughs> if I stream tomorrow, it'll be around 7 or 7.30. So keep uh, your alerts on. If I do it on Monday, it'd probably be a similar time, 7 or 7.30. Tuesday, I would probably start earlier in the morning. Uh, I might do a stream for Nintendo Prime at 10 a.m. till noon, and then I'd probably do a six-hour stream from 1 to 7 p.m. And this is all in U.S. Central Time, so... Anyways, guys, thanks so much for coming, and as a reminder, Retro Game Treasure is the service we used here today. Uh, you go to RetroGameTreasure.com, you use the code 5J to get a discount on your checkout, and uh, what they do is they send you three to five retro games every month based on your preferences. Uh, they're a mystery, though, so that's the fun part. Um, I've been doing this for like 14 or 15 months. It's been a long time, and uh, I, I never get sick of it. So I'm going to keep on going with this. I might change what systems I want games for. The Game Gear 1 still seem finicky, so I might, uh, I might have to take Game Gear off my list of games for now. But uh, they did some good, some good ones, so... Uh, and, uh, Super Star Wars and Sonic, uh, a good Sonic, although weird, uh, and, uh, a Pokemon game. I mean, that was a really good box. So, thanks for coming, guys, and, uh, <clears throat> hopefully I'll catch you tomorrow, and if not tomorrow, then I guess it's gonna have to be Monday. Uh, happy 4th of July to all of, uh, my viewers out there that, um, are celebrating over the weekend in the U.S., and if not, happy weekend. Uh, know that we're still wishing you well. We, me. I go on and on at the end of these things, so I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for coming. Bye.